Hey guys, uh, Jesus, si gusta apague la camarita un ratito, no se vaya a distraer. Be careful, please. Ok, ok, gracias.
Hey guys, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Hey everybody, good evening. Hello, hello. Good evening, teacher. Hey guys, how are you? I am fine. Nice, that is really good to hear. So uh, thank you so much for joining. Thank you so much for being here. Give me just a second. So thanks so much uh, for joining today's class. All right, we are going to have class number nine today. So I see that almost everybody is here. So really, really cool. Guys, como estuvo su día? How was your day? Everything good? Very good, teacher. Very good. Nice, nice. And tomorrow is Thursday, so really cool, I guess. De casi fin de semana. No puedo decir que es un día productivo. Oh, okay, nice. That's really good to hear. So cool, cool. Let me see. Give me a second. Just let me turn this on and let me get ready for ya. Okay, so eh, déjeme pasar asistencia rapidito. Let me go over the attendance, guys. Please help me with the present. Eh, están listos? If you're ready. So, give me one second. Okay. Hi, teacher. Hey, Miss. Nice to hear you. Me alegro mucho que ya está acá with us and ready. So, uh, Jocelyn está por acá, I believe. Yes, gracias, Jocelyn. Hi. Thank you so much. See you there. Uh, Norberto. Thank you, Thank you uh, Sandra Rodas. Okay, Sandra is not here yet. And uh, Brian. Rene, is Rene here? Okay, Daisy, por ahí vía Daisy. I'm here. Thank you, Miss. Danny. Hi, teacher. Hello, Giovanni. Danis. Yeah, I saw you, Dennis, right there. Yes. Uh, Jesus también está por ahí, so I think he's in the motorcycle right now. Present. Hey, thank you, Jesus. Be careful, please. I'm pretty, you know, worried. <laughs> and uh, Jerixa. Present. Thank you very much, Jerixa. And Ingrid, ya escuché por ahí a Ingrid as well. So me alegra mucho que you are here uh, and you could make it. Uh, Claribel. Present me. Thank you. I am here. Match. Jackie. También por ahí via Hello, Miss. Nice to see you. And uh, Moises. Present. Thank, Thank you. Thank you, Moises. Nice. Anna Delmi. Yeah. Anna, Anna. Let me check. Not yet. Okay. 
And, uh, por ahí creo que Brenda se iba conectando también. So Brenda is on the way. Okay, hey, thank you, Miss. Está yeah, durmiendo, so, Brenda. Right on time, cabalito, a la hora. You know, so you got a good timing. Sorry. And... Es que se me arruinó la compu y, y, y descargué el Zoom en, en el otro teléfono. Ah. No, Miss, pero gracias, gracias por conectarse. Thank you so much for that. En Italia, por ahí también vi a, a Natalie. So I, I, I prefer to call you gracias. Natalie, you know. <laughs> I think it's better. And Sandra Flores. Sandra, are you around? Uh, no sé, creo que escuché a Sandra, but I'm not sure. No, I don't see her. Okay. No, not yet. Okay. Okay, everybody. So, Ana, Ana, creo que ya estaba por acá. Ana, tell me. Present teacher. Yes. Thank you very much. Okay. Okay, everybody. So, thanks a lot. Y gracias por unirse today. Mañana terminamos nuestra semana dos. Entonces, es como bien rápido. You know, time is flying. So we are going to uh, take advantage of uh, every opportunity we have. So let me go ahead and let's voy a compartir mi pantalla. So let me share my agenda for today. Vamos a, a revisar ahora. We are going to actually practice. Vamos a practicar un poquito la parte de obligations that we started yesterday. Eh, so trabajamos un poquito ayer con have to, I need to. So today, vamos ya a practicar preguntas, you know, everything. And of course, vamos a incluir también un par de numeritos. So we are going to be working with some uh, ordinal numbers and also some, yeah, cardinal and ordinal numbers, right? So that is pretty much one of the things that we have for the day. And uh, guys, eh, to get started, vamos a revisar un poquito the next conversation that we have eh, today, right? So the first one is about Adele. So we have Susan and also we have Adele. Guys, denme un segundito solamente, give me one second. Um, alguien está teniendo problemas con la conexión. Hold on, hold on. Okay. Just a second. Okay, thank you for the time. So hopefully they'll make it. So um, we have here like a little You're conversation. Welcome. And um, this is between Susan and Adele. Okay. And uh, so tenemos como una little, this is just like a little conversation. So, and, uh, and Adele, me, please, can you be so kind? Y me ayuda a leer la parte de Susan. And Danny, please, me ayuda a leer la parte de Adele. Thank you so much. Empezamos, ya, uh, Yes, sure, sure. Okay. Adele, please check my agent. When is the meeting with the consultant? It's Danny or Danny. <laughs> no, it's Anthony. Okay, sorry, Anthony. <laughs> yes, you please. Uh, on Monday, November uh, 22. What about, uh, what about the conference with the Mexican representative? Representative. Mm -hmm. Eh, teacher, la verdad que ahí sí, no, no, no sé cómo pronunciar ese. Le ayudo, no se me, preocupe. Me quedé so it's on Friday. En la fecha. Ok, it's on Friday. It's on Friday the 26th. 
solo sí, solo lea lo normal. Ajá, esa es la pronunciación del, de la N, N, D, y la T, normal. Mm -hmm. Eat on Friday the 26. Yes, Así. that's it. Normal. Yes. Yeah, ya, ya les voy ah. a comentar por qué. Yes. Okay, thank you. Thank you, guys. So You're they are welcome. having a meeting. Okay. So the meeting is on Monday, November the 22nd, and the other one, there is a conference on Friday the 26th. All right. So, tenemos un poquito acá los números ordinales. So we have some ordinal numbers. Okay. And let's go over these activities. Oops, I'm sorry. So talking a little bit about uh, ordinal numbers. Hold on, something happened to my presentation. Okay, we have the ordinal numbers, que son los que nos ayudan a um, hablar un poquito, right? De nuestras actividades, the dates, okay? So this is what we will be doing. Okay, um, here we have the month of the year. So yo creo que todos se los pueden, right? Everybody knows the month of the year. But uh, for calibration purposes, repitamos, please. So let's repeat January. 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 February. 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 March. 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 April. 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 May. 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 June. 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 July. July, 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 August, 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 that are the days. So vamos a intentar organizar nuestras actividades, okay? Um, so activity number five here, it says, write the name and the month in the calendar. Vamos a obviar esto. So le voy a compartir acá mi pantalla. Let me share my screen. Para que podamos ver un poquito de cómo se leen también, right? So eh, anteriormente, module one, yeah. vimos un poquito de pronunciation, de ordinal numbers. Hola, hola. Un pequeño recordatorio. Hello. Pero es que fíjate que estoy en clase. Oh, oh se le quedó el micrófono. Ok. <risa> ya se va. Ya se va. La <risa> no, guys, just in case. Yo siempre intento apagarles los micrófonos. No vaya a ser que es algo muy personal, you know. And we never know. So, <risa> it's okay. So, let's take a look at the ordinal numbers that we have. Ok. So, we have, for example, the cardinal is uno, pero cuando uh -huh. hablamos de la fecha sería ST. So, that is the first. Okay. La Two, le ponemos en ED, and this becomes second. First, second, yeah? Three, le pongo RD, y se convierte, se convierte en? Third. First, second, third, exactly. Third. So first, mm. second, and third, yeah. So cuando hablamos de orden, so it's pretty much the same. Hey, Sandra, me alegra mucho que pudo solucionarlo. Thank you so much for joining. Thank you, Miss. So yeah, we got first, second, and third. Y después del tres, guys, after number three, ¿qué le ponemos? What do we add? Th. Th, very good. So solo le agrego un sonido de Z, right? Four. So first, second, third, fourth. Okay. Four. El cinco se cambia de five y se pronuncia ahora como fifth. Fifth. Fourth. Fifth. 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 Okay. Okay. Pero hay un pequeño, una pequeña dificultad con el seis. Because when you pronounce it, it's un six. Si le agregan el sonido de Z, sería como six. <laughs> es bien difícil. Entonces lo podemos pronunciar de la misma forma. Six. No cambia. Uh -huh. No le vamos okay. a agregar algo más. Ok. So, six. No, no, that would be very hard to pronounce. Ok. And then with the rest hacemos lo mismo. Eight, nine, ten. Pero ahora vamos a pronunciarlo y vamos a agregarle este sonido. That is very nice. Ok. Que es el, la Z española, let's say. 
es el mismo sonido. So, TH, everybody, repitamos el sonido. Solo es aire, ok. TH. So, remember, el sonido es. TH. H. Hagamos el sonido, guys. Porque no lo tenemos en El Salvador. En nuestro español no lo tiene. So we have to make it. So, now let's repeat. First. Third. Third. Second. Second. Third. 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 Ten. 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 Okay, ten and ten. All right. So, and then we just continue con los, el resto de números es lo mismo. Yeah, so we go like 11, 12, etc. Cuando llegamos al 21, this is different because tenemos 20 y luego tenemos uno. So, vamos a utilizar el mismo de acá arriba. So, sería 20. First. First. 21st. First. Exactly. First. Significa que le voy a llegar ese T. 21st. Mm -hmm. I got 22. Yes. Pero como son ordinal numbers, ¿qué voy a utilizar? I have 20. Okay. Second. Exactly. 22nd. So Very good. 22nd. El 23. How do I say 23? 20. 23rd, 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 23r
Un poco de lengua, ten. Ten. Ok, ahora ten. une el sonido, ten. Ten. Ok, this is the tenth number, exactly. It's a ten. All right. So, ten. no tenemos el sonido. Thank you so much, Elizabeth. No tenemos el sonido, así que toca como obligar un poquito, y, you know, para que lo podamos obtener. So, yes. Now, ¿para qué voy a utilizarlos? Well, first, I'm going to use it para hablar de orden. Ok, so lo primero que tengo que hacer. The first thing I have to do. Lo segundo que tengo que hacer. The second thing I have to do. Lo tercero, the third thing. Pero también vamos a utilizarlos para fechas, ¿ok? So, ¿qué vamos a hacer ahorita? We are going to talk about number one. Hablemos un poquito de dates, ¿ok? Vamos a practicar un poco dates. So, ¿qué fechas tenemos, you know, eh, in, uh, in our year, in our holidays? So, ¿qué es lo que celebramos? What do we celebrate? Or what are the most important dates for you, ¿ok? So, what are the most important dates for you? Okay, so everybody, I want you to make a list. Okay, vamos a hacer una lista de todas las important dates for you. So, ¿cómo lo vamos a hacer? Tenemos el día, okay? Ahora vamos a agregarle el mes. Primero ponemos el mes y después el día. For example, para mí un día importante es March 1st. Okay, another important day is October 6th, okay, another important day, and then I can start making, puedo hacer la lista, you know, de eventos that I consider important, so voy a hacer esto más pequeño, this is just an example, okay, but you can make your own list, so, the most important, important dates for me, okay? And I can start making my list. For example, el cumpleaños de mi madre, yeah, so that is April 13th, y le agrego TH, okay? Uh, my own birthday, October the 6th, y le agrego TH, okay? Uh, Mother's Day, on May 10th, okay? Y le agrego TH. So, podemos hacer solo una lista, okay, de todas las fechas que son importantes here. So, let's do it right now. Primero el mes, first month, y luego el día. Okay? Y acá tenemos una referencia, if you need to remember cómo se escribe. Si el número no está acá, most likely solo se le agrega TH. So, you cannot just TH. Teacher, ahí yes? en April 13, no sería eh, eh, RD. No, eh, eso siempre no. llevan, eso se consideran acá. Por ejemplo, el 11 lleva TH. Después del 11 hasta el 20, todos van a llevar TH. So you go like 11th, 12th, ok, eh, 13th. So esos llevan TH. Those go with TH. Mm -hmm. ah, ok, thank you. Yes, you are welcome. There you go. So, I'll give you like three minutes. Tienen como tres minutitos para escribir las fechas importantes for you guys.
Okay, guys, si necesitan ayuda, please let me know so we can check. Cuando, teacher, cuando digo eh, 31, sería 31st. October, yeah, sería como ese de último, 31st, el 31 de octubre, yes. Okay. But not because, not because of Halloween, right? <laughs> no. <laughs> Your birthday. No, December 31, 31st. Oh, I thought October, yeah. <laughs> so December 31st, okay, okay. No. Hola, trece. Sí, para decir, ajá, trece. Sería thirteen. Yeah, thirteen. Uh, yeah, y le agregamos el sonido de th, thirteen. Thirteen, algo así. Yeah, es como, okay, lo voy a escribir. I'm gonna write it here. Siempre es con th, okay. So you get the number that is uh, third, thirteen. Okay, el número es thirteen. Pero como yo le agrego Ajá, ese sonido, solamente es 13th. Y el... Con, con Z al final, digamos. Exacto, con un sonido. 15. ¿Norberto? No, Brian. Oh, Brian. Oh, my God. Le escuché la voz de Norberto. Oh, my God, I said. Creo que lo escuché un poco lejos. That's why. Tell me, Brian. 15. 15. 15. Yeah, so, sería lo mismo, you got 15, we feasting, I'm writing, so 15, okay, le agregamos de H, 15. Mm -hmm. uh, yes, Moises, exactly, 24, solamente se le agrega TH, yes. So one more minute, guys, and then un minutito, write the most important dates for you, okay? Y ahora, ¿cómo lo voy a presentar? So, this is the most important dates for me, so tengo que decir por qué son importantes. So, April 13th, because it is. So, voy a decir por qué. I'm going to say why this number is important for me. So, April 13th is important is important because it is. Let me make this a little bigger. Okay, so lo vamos a presentar this way. April 13th is important because it is. Y luego decimos de que es. Okay, October 6th, it is important because it is. And May the 10th, okay. For example, okay, April 13th is important because it is my mother's, my mother's birthday, okay? October 6th is important because it is my birthday, so I get older, okay? Um, eso no era. So this is not, uh, let me see, oh my God, another important date for me. June 28th, okay, is important because it is the celebration of my graduation. Okay, so so any day that is important for you, okay, so you can mention you can mention it like this. It's important because so it is important because it is okay. Um, guys, any question? Are we good? Are we okay? Anything that you got not clear? So we can clarify it. So, um, ¿está claro cómo, cómo explicar? How to give a little explanation de las fechas? How to talk about them? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay. Okay, so podemos utilizar esto to make it easy, right? So April 13th is important because it is. 
okay? October 6th, it's important because it is my birthday, okay? Uy, birthday is a mal escrito, I'm sorry about that. So, yeah, oh no, I made a mistake, I was writing too fast. But yes, it tiene un error de spelling. Yes. Okay, ahí está. So it's correct right. now. Okay, everybody. So, vamos a explicar por qué esas fechas son importantes, okay, y qué significan para ustedes. What it means to you. So, allow me just one second. Let me go there. Y los voy a invitar a sesiones, okay. So you can listen to your classmates. Eh, ¿Alguien tiene una pregunta antes de ir? No. Okay. So everybody, let's go there. We have uh, uh, five minutes to talk to your classmates, okay? Y escuchar por qué son importantes esas fechas. So let's go, let's go. Sir. Hola, Miss. Eh, hola, este, yo quería hacerle un comentario Dígame. respecto a esta, hacer respecto a estas dinámicas. Es que realmente a mí sí me gustaría saber si yo estoy pronunciando bien o si estoy, si, si cómo formo las frases y palabras está bien. Y los compañeros, pues, de pronto sí me puedan corregir, pero de pronto no. Y, y siento que a veces digo mal o pronuncio mal y me voy quedando así porque no, no hay manera de corregirlo porque no sé si realmente lo que yo estoy diciendo es así. Sure. Eh, ajá, you know, yo, yeah. ¿sí? A veces entro, to be honest, because I'm jumping, you know, intentando escuchar tanto como pueda. So, eh, what I normally do es si escucho algo que está como un poco mal pronunciado or something, se los estoy escribiendo en el chat. Most likely, eh, se los dejo y uno como privado. Entonces, most likely, hasta el momento no le he escuchado mal pronunciación or something, y por eso no le he escrito any comment. But, si hay alguna palabra que you are not quite sure, con gusto la podemos revisar, you know. And, yeah, I'm gonna, eh, a veces es bastante difícil porque somos bastantes, you know, eh, to, mm -hmm. to, to listen to everybody, por mucho que queramos, it's pretty hard. Pero si tiene, like, any specific word that you're not sure, o, o quiere comentarlo, you know, con gusto, lo, we can take a look at it. Podemos mm -hmm. revisar. Mm -hmm. Bueno. Yes. Bye, entonces. Yes, yes. Pero Entré. igual, si tiene, like, any, any suggestion, es more than welcome, es bien recibida. Sí, solo eso, porque, eh, pues, yo... Sí me ha tocado a veces tratar de hablar en inglés y me ha tocado comunicarme con gente que no habla español y el inglés es pateadísimo, es horrible, pero pues me hago entender, pero no, no es lo ideal, ¿verdad? Porque es pateado, pateado. Pero quiere la seguridad, yo want to make sure que lo que está haciendo es, está correcto. I Ajá, I entonces cuando, cuando trato de comunicarme, ay, dudo bastante porque no sé si... Yo, yo me imagino que lo estoy hablando mal y lo estoy hablando pateado y lo más seguro. Entonces, por eso. Pero, pero pues ahí vamos en el camino. Ahí si me escucha mal, pues ahí y, me dice. No, of course. You know, normally eh, I do it. Si escucho una palabra mal, like, I take it y luego la retomo. O como le digo, si algunos compañeros eh, se las, you know, porque no todos aceptan el, el, la corrección en a good way, so se las escribo por lo general en el chat de forma privada, you know, just eh, para que le quede ahí and, and you try to get it. But, but no worries, I'm gonna try to, sí, you know, e, e, intento eh, saltar como del uno al otro para escuchar tantos como pueda. But I'll try mm -hmm. to find a way, voy a buscar una forma para que podamos practicar un poco más pronunciation. Mm -hmm. Thank you, thank you Miss for the, for the comment. Gracias. Ahora como entro. <risa> es en el teléfono, ¿verdad? So, in your phone, sí. en la parte de arriba, en la parte como de arribita de su teléfono, le va a aparecer un cuadrito. Ah, es un sí. cuadrito pequeño que dice grupo reducido. Solo le da ahí y se va. Vale. Teacher. Hola, Jesus. Hola, mire, físico, y sí tengo un problema porque no ando la cosita donde... Ando en la moto porque ando otra moto. ¿Me puedo meter al grupo y solo escuchar? 
Sí, sí, por supuesto, no se preocupe. So, ok. Yeah. Gracias. Pero be careful. I'm pretty worried, you know. Be careful, please. Vaya, pues dale, del The most important date for me um, April 29th uh, is important because it's my my son birthday. Entre las pandillas pone. Uh, Están resueltos. December 29th. Uh, is is important because it's my daughter birthdays. Um, Qué fecha para cumplir año. <laughs> la misma fecha no hicieron otros. Uh, November twenty first is important because my mother's birthday. Oh. October. October 18. October 18. 18 is important because in my my birthday. Only te that. Sale, te salen caros los últimos meses del año. Del... Sí, la verdad que sí. <ríe> ah, buena fecha para cumplir año. Sí. Vaya quien va, Giovanni. José Norberto, ya está listo. Here. José Norberto. Dale, José. Ok. No, November 16th. Uh, is important because it is my birthday. November. November 16th. Uh, okay. April. Uh, 28 uh, is important uh, because it is um, Brady the my my girl. So February February. ¿Qué le hace a tu novia contanos en el cumpleaños? Celebration celebration. Yes, la llevas a comer, la sorprendes con algún regalo. Fíjate que más que todo la sorprendo así como un regalo. Por, ah. Porque sí, aquí <risa> casi no hay es, lugar turístico para salir. Qué sleepy. Yes. Vaya, pues continue. <risa> Uh, February 13th uh, is uh, important because it's um, the brighter than my target. What? Repeat this... again, please. Hello? Repeat again. The 13th is uh, important uh, because it's uh, brighter than my target. Daughter. So you have a daughter. Daughter, the the hija, pues. Oh, yeah, okay. yeah, daughter. Uh huh, daughter. daughter. So daughter. you have a daughter. Daughter. Okay. No parece José Norberto. How old is your daughter? ¿Cuántos años tiene? How old is your daughter? Um, seven years. Wow, seven years. Oh. That's so cute. Qué cute. Y la última fecha importante quizás para todo es diciembre 31. 31. Eh, new Year's. Sí, first of all is the New Year. Yes, it's important. Ok, finish. Ok, thank you. ¿Quién nos falta? 20, 20, 23. It's birthday, my mom. It's, it's it only now. 
Ok. ¿Estoy? Ah, The most important day for me, on number one, January 26, uh, is important because it is my mother's birthday. Another day important is um, May day then. Um, is my celebration of Married Siver. Um, other day, May I'm sorry to interrupt. You mean your anniversary? Yes. Oh, so May the 10th is your anniversary. May the 10th, um, anniversary of Mary Civil. Oh, civil, civil Mary? Anniversary. Anniversary is okay. Oh, anniversary. Yeah, okay. you can say anniversary. Anniversary. Uh -huh. uh, May 16, my celebration birthday. June 21, is celebration of birthday of my wife. Um, Julie. Julie, four. Julie, yes. July. Twenty first. Twenty first. July, four. Four. Is university. Um. Married you. I'm sorry. What is that? Uh, civil married, mm -hmm. um, me, um, child married. Oh, the religious wedding. So yeah. the religious ah. anniversary. Oh, thank you. Okay, so it is the religious. You can call it anniversary. So an uh, anniversary is okay. Okay. Yeah. So this you is religious. Religious. Religious anniversary. anniversary. Uh huh. And or religious. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, anniversary. Your anniversary is okay. I'll finish in December 26 of celebration birthday of my daughter. It's John John Twimmy. It's my grandmother. June, uh, July 4th, uh, yes, my dear, my, my spirit, my mother. Um, um, February 5th is important because it is the celebration finish uh, curso de Excel intermedio, pero no sé cómo se dice. Excelente. Oh, Half. Sí. Eh, ya no vas a enseñar, Dani. Ya no vas a enseñar Excel. Eh, la otra semana termina Excel avanzado 1. Wow. Vaya por si quieren ahí. Que, que, pero voy a por Sí, sí, si quieren les, les paso el les paso de, 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 de 6 a 8. Ay, de 6. Meli, escuchá de 6 a 8. Les Está paso todo. el formato. <risa> Se siente <Sí>. bien. <risa> cuatro horas, pasas igual que yo también. Sí, ajá, cuatro horas. Yo, por ejemplo, ahora paso de 6 a 8. De... Te pregunto, ¿por qué estamos construyendo la campaña aquí? Teacher. Teacher. Mil disculpas que me salí rápido porque me metí en el, en el grupo. Oiga. Ah, no, no se preocupe, no worries. Thank you. Gracias por entrar. No. Either way, thanks a lot. All right, guys. Let me just make sure que todos estén de vuelta and nobody's in the group. 
yes everybody's back so thanks everybody for coming back okay so that was very nice i listened to you know a couple of um achievements okay that you have so the los logros que han obtenido and and they are like important dates so that's very important uh before anything guys Revisemos una palabra, all right, that it's a little bit um, tricky. Okay, let's call it that way. So it's birthday. So everybody, let's repeat. Birthday. Birthday. Birth. Birthday. 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 My birthday. My birthday. birthday. Birth. 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 Birthday. My birthday. 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 My, my mother's birthday. My, my mother's birthday. birthday. My sister's birthday. My sister's birthday. 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 Exactly. So remember okay. that it's birth. Okay. This is called birthday. So no birthday. <laughs> okay. But this is just called a birthday. All right. So my birthday, my sister's birthday, my mother's birthday. All right. So good, good. I would like to listen to, uh, you know, some of you. What are the most important dates? Okay. So volunteers. Do I have any volunteer guys? Me, teacher. Awesome. Thank you, Brenda. Go ahead, please. Okay. The most important dates for me. November 8th is my birthday. Hey, nice. July, July 24 is important for me because is my daughter's birthday. In September, ahí teníamos todos la confusión, no la confusión, sino que no sabemos cómo se dice 13. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. No worries. So it is, I'm going to share my screen. Okay. So, es el mismo 13, right? It is the same number. So I got here 13. Okay. Pero como son ordinales, le voy a agregar solo la TH. 13. Y le agrego el sonido de 13. 13. 13. 13. 13. Yes, yes, exactly. That's the sound. Yes. Okay. September 13 is important because it's my son's birthday. In December 20, 24, 24 is important for me because it's Christmas. Okay. That's it. Okay, nice. I like it. That was very pretty cool. cool. A very good pronunciation of the numbers, I have to say. Everybody, let's repeat. 13. 13. 13. 13. 13. So, everybody, hagamos este sonido. 13. So, 13. 13. 13. Okay. 13. Pronunciamos ambos. 13. 13. 13. 13. 13. 13. 13. Solo es agregarle un, un, un sonidito ahí. <laughs> Solo le vamos a agregar un sonidito ahí. Ok, 13. So the first one, ok. El primer número es el mismo, ok. Lo único que yo le estoy agregando es este sonido que es... Ok. Van a terminar como... All right. So, everybody... Empieza con Z y termina con Z. Everybody, repitamos esto. 13. 13. 13. Ok, 13. 13. Okay, let's repeat this one. Four. 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 Four.
No se preocupen por eso, because we are doing a good job so far. Y estamos súper bien con el tiempo as well. So, talking about these important dates, okay, so I heard the, the month correctly. Solamente recordemos que es July, okay, so July. July. And this July. is la A U is August. July. July and August. August. Oh, oh, oh. August. 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 And this is August. April. 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 Como una April. 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 All right. So, one more volunteer, please. Que nos quiere contar de las import, important dates for you guys? Me, teacher. Sure, Ingrid. Go ahead, please. And then we are going to listen to Elizabeth. Nice, Elizabeth. I like it. Yeah, so Ingrid, go, please. Most important uh, date for me is um, January seventh. Uh, uh, is uh, because it's birthday my daughter. Uh, other uh, my uh, my thirty. Yeah, because birthday my daughter. Uh, September thirteenth. Thirteenth. September thirteenth. Yes. Uh, because birthday my husband, husband. Um, December twenty is my birthday. Is birthday my mother. Yeah, it's other important date is um, June June fourth. Uh, did my grandmother. Uh, July 9th uh, is did my greet my mother. Grandmother, perdón. Eh, sorry, the, the eh, July. I'm sorry, Bill. the death uh -huh, of your grandmother. Okay, okay. I'm sorry about yeah, that. Yeah, it's in grandmother mother and grip my mom, grandmother. Okay, yeah, thank you. Oh. Okay, November is my, is a uh, uh, most import is the November 36th is my birthday. So November, can you repeat the date, please? November? 26. Okay, 26. so November 26. All right. It's Thank you. Day. Thank you, Ingrid. Very nice job. That was pretty good. I like the dates. You mentioned them perfectly. Very nice. Solo a little something, okay? Um, so normally, como es el cumpleaños de mi mami, you know, a mi papá, etc. So, digo primero eh, de quién es, okay? Y luego le agrego birthday. For example, my son's oh. birthday. Lo demás, super bien, Ingrid. Very oh, cool. Okay. Por ejemplo, por ahí si tienen niñas, right? So, my daughter's birthday. Ah. So, primero es de quién y luego la palabra birthday. Uh -huh. Ah, so, por ejemplo, my mother's birthday. So, con los cumpleaños siempre mencionamos de quién, right? My son's birthday, perfect. my daughter's birthday, my mother's birthday, my niece's birthday, and so forth, all right? So, my pretty birthday. good job, pretty good job. Solamente sería hacer el cambio, but cool. Brenda, dígame. No, 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 teacher. Estaba repitiendo. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> okay, but but yeah, exactly. So, siempre decimos como de que, for example, si es de mi abuelo, my grandfather, eh, okay, my grandfather's, yeah, birthday. Exactly. So, this is the way it goes. Mm -hmm. Primero digo el de quien, all right. Pretty nice job. Elizabeth, I saw that you work with the hand up, okay? So, let us listen to you, girl. <laughs> Um, January 21 it's important mm -hmm. because, because it is my grandson birthday. Wow, you got grandsons. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, you look very young. How old is the baby? Yes, es el que aparece, el tiene? que aparece en la foto de perfil de WhatsApp. Eh, tiene un año. Oh wow, so you are a, a grandmother. Yes. Oh my goodness, you look very young. Okay, okay. Um, so you said January twenty first. Twenty first. Twenty first, right? El veintiuno. So twenty first. Sí, 
Ah, 21st. Mm -hmm. 21st. Mm -hmm. uh, October 12th is important because it is my birthday. Oh, oh, it is your birthday. So oh, my, my birthday is in October too. Nice. Yes. Okay. Cool. Okay. Feb February. Mm -hmm. February. Once. First. First. ¿Cómo? Ahorita se lo escribo. Es el primero, right? Sí. But se pronuncia como una E. Entonces. Ah, sí. First. 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 Uh -huh. first. first. Algo así, algo así. Se lo he escrito first. en la segunda, es como la, más o menos la pronunciación. Uh -huh. Like first. first. Exactly, first. Mm -hmm. Yes. February, okay. first. Mm -hmm. It's important okay. because mm -hmm. it is my oldest son's birthday. Mm -hmm. Okay. So it is your oldest son's birthday. Okay, very nice. Elizabeth, you did it nicely. That was very cool. Solo ayúdeme con una palabrita, please. Es esta palabra, you know, que siempre nos da problemitas. Here, so it's bird. Bird. Se la voy, se la voy a escribir, hmm? más o menos, ¿cómo se pronuncia? Okay, es como bird. Birds. Birthday. 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 Exactly, it's a birthday. Mm -hmm. Okay. So my birthday. Yes, very good. You got it. Nice, nice. But very good job. I like it. That was very nice. So, guys, talking about this, okay, talking about some dates. Now, let's move on and let's talk a little bit about obligations. So, durante el año, we always have some, like, obligations during the year, all right? What about this month? ¿Tienen alguna obligación para este año? Do you have any obligation for this year or this month? Yes. Okay. Todos tenemos cosas programadas, right? We have programmed activities for this year and this month. So my next question is, okay, my next question is, give me one second. Let me just erase this. Okay. So. What are your what are your programmed activities for this month? All right. So hablemos de este mes solamente. Let's talk about this month. Let's talk about March. So cuáles son algunas actividades que ya tienen programadas? Activities that you have duties for. That that is kind of your obligation. All right. For example, uh, we finish the module. We finish the module on, guys, cuando terminamos. We finish the module. Yes. Empezamos el primero de enero. We, I mean, el primero de, de marzo. So March, we finish yeah. the module on March. ¿Qué fecha, guys? Do you remember? Um, when you see? The 26th. Let me see, let me see, let me confirm. Oh, yes. So we finished the module on March 26th. Exactly. Yes. So, como es un poco difícil pronunciar con TH, solo puedo decir 26 y está bien. So we finished okay. the module on March 26th. Okay, we finished module number two. Mm -hmm. So, ¿qué otras actividades tienen? What other program activities do you have for this month? In my case, for example, debo de enviar mi programación de actividades. I have to, ayer vimos have to, so yo debo de, I have to send my, uh, my reports on Saturday, March, wait, Saturday, comma, March, ¿cuándo es este sábado? March. 13th. Okay, so I have to say my my reports on March 13th, all right? So what about you? ¿Cuáles son algunas actividades programadas that you have for this month? I will give you five minutes, guys. Pueden escribirlas o solo revisen las actividades que tienen. Uy, está volando. 
So, no es necesario, but si se sienten más cómodos escribiéndolo, you are good to, to complete them, ¿ok? New vocabulary siempre es bienvenido, así que si encuentran una palabra nueva, so please write it down, o la pueden compartir con nosotros, so we can check it out together, all right? So, everybody, tienen cinco minutos para escribir sus actividades programadas solo por este mes, for this month. ¿Qué deben de hacer? What do you have to do this month? Hey, Rene, nice to see you here. Sandra Rodas. Hey, Sandra, thank you so much for being here as well. Hi, Miss. Hello, Miss. Nice to see you. How are you? Ah, Kitty, che, queriéndome conectar, pero me cuesta por rato. Me imagino. Yeah, that's too bad that you're having internet issues. Pero gracias, Miss, por estar acá. Thank you so much for being here. Teacher, Hola, para eh, verbo entregar, git o ham. Eh, hay ¿Cuál es la, git, pero cuál, digamos, no hay correcta o no, que puede ser git o ham. Mm, depende, de hecho. Por, usted puede decir, por ejemplo, I have to give my reports. Pero si quiere sonar un poco más, eh, I would say más profesional. You can use, I have to hand in my report. Oh, very good. Then, mm -hmm. teacher. Y si quisiera explicar que tengo que entregar una tarea el sábado, podría utilizar I have to am. Handing. Handing es entregar. I have to hand in my homework. My homework, yeah. So, hand, pero handing es como algo físico, ¿verdad? So, si lo entrega, sí, sí, si lo imprime, por ejemplo, y los entrega, so I have to hand in. Pero también ahora en un ambiente digital. Exacto, en un ambiente digital, usted dice tengo que subir la tarea, right? So, entonces puede utilizar I have to submit. Submit okay. es como oh, subir. Okay. O también podría ser upload. Pero upload es más como, como un video, you know, que usted sube un video. So, eh, I would say submit is better. So, I have to okay, submit. Okay, thanks. Uh -huh. Two more minutes, guys. Let me know. Me avisan si tienen preguntas. I don't, teacher. Okay, you're done. Nice, nice. Thank you. No, viste. Se gana bien. No te digo nada. Thank you for the confirmation. Anna, also, thanks a lot for the confirmation.
Okay, guys, so tell me what are some of the program activities that you have for this month? I guess most of you are done. Thank you guys for the confirmation. Okay, so Jackie, Danny, they are also done. All right, thanks a lot. So, um, volunteers, who would like to tell us a little bit about the activities that you have? Hi. Not all of them, right? So, algunas. Yes, um, tell me, please. Go, go, go. Teacher, uh, I I want to talk about uh, important activities, but not only uh, of this month. Uh, mm -hmm. I want to talk okay, about no uh, important uh, days uh, around the year. The year. The year. Sure, sure, yeah. go ahead. Yeah, about this month, I have to send weekly report on Friday uh, 12. Uh, this okay. report is is monthly and um, all year. I have okay. to send a res results report uh, at okay. final of each cycle. Está bien dicho así? The semester. Semester, yes. At the, at the end of the semester. Mm -hmm. Yes, I have to send resu results report uh, at final of semester it's semester at the end uh, at yeah, the end at of the semester, the semester. Uh, yes okay at the end of the semester and this final uh, this end semester is on june 22nd okay uh, i have to send the early report in december 22nd yeah it's all right. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, that's pretty good. So okay. in December, by December the 22nd, you have to send like a yearly report, you said. Yes, a yearly okay. report. Okay, that was pretty good. That was pretty good. Yeah, only just the word semester, right? Mm -hmm. So we can use it at the end of the semester or by okay. the end. También podría ser by the end of the semester, como a final este. So by the end, by the by end. the end of semester, of the semester, yeah. So okay. we can use both at the end or by the end. Mm -hmm. oh. Yeah, thank you. Oh, Thanks okay. for sharing that. Okay. I got twenty one. Me teacher. Yes, please, Ingrid, go ahead. Um. I do program it and is my is most. Yes, and I have to deliver the documents the uh, to INSA for for the next model. Yeah, that's true. Mm -hmm. Next week, <laughs> it's true. Para que se acuerden todos, compañeros. Thank you. Yeah, that's totally right, guys. Ya le mandaron el les mandaron el mensaje de recursos humanos in your companies. Voy a aprovechar el comercial, you know. <laughs> Yeah, guys, yesterday yeah, me dijeron yes. que ya les mandaron el, comer el comercial, ya les mandaron los documentos, right? Nice. Ahora me mm -hmm. llamaron yeah. para consultar si vamos a seguir. Ah, yes. okay. Ahora lo... Igual, Igual lo grabo, no quiere seguir. Guys, todos siguen, ¿verdad? Sí, Everybody yo, yo me continue. retiro. Brian yes. no va a seguir. Ah, Brian, con... el no, Brian. No, no, no. no, no guys. El único que no roba, ¿Por qué nos abandonaste, Brian? No, 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 no aquí sigo. Y Brian nos debe una salida ahora que recuerdo, así que no sí. se va antes de, de, de pagarnos la KFG. salida. <ríe> Yo ni <ríe> recuerdo dónde fue que prometió, but, but I remember. <ríe> Marvin dijo que los iba, les iba a pagar el, eh, donde está el deslizadero de Pigmy. Marvin era. Uh, Did Pigmy. Marvin promise that? Sí, I don't know. Marvin, I think it was Marvin, no Marvin. Rene. O René, I don't know. Pero ellos Danny. Danny. Uno de los dos. Yeah, so alguien, guys, eh, por si no recuerdan. Así dijimos que íbamos a ir a comer pupú y nunca y, fuimos. Es cierto. Y Moyo, mm. bueno, Vamos, pues. alguien prometió que nos iba a pagar la entrada del, del deslizadero a picnic, you know. Mar Lo estamos I esperando. Remember, Mar 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 okay. Yo creo que fue René. Cualquiera puede hacerlo ahorita, no hay problema. <laughs> So, more, you, we, you know, it's welcome. So, si alguien quiere sponsor, eh, si alguien quiere ser el, ¿cómo se dice? El patrocinio. So, if you want to be a sponsor, 
You can definitely, you, you are more than welcome. So, pero es cierto, lo de las pupusas tampoco. So, también lo de las pupusas quedó pendiente. Vamos a los planes. It would be uh, nice, pero yo creo que algunos se les hace bien difícil. Because remember que hay algunos de Zacate, you que know, de Santa de la, Ana. La capital. Exactly, exactly. So not everybody is from San Salvador. Pero sí sería bonito. Podrían venir. Lo voy a ir a traer en la moto. Va, reunámonos. <laughs> para que todos nos quede igual, reunámonos en San Miguel, va. No, wait, wait, ¿quién dijo que no se iba a traer en, en moto? Jesús. Yo, yo, yo. Jesus, y Jesús todavía ve en la moto. Jesus. No, no, ya, ya, ahorita acabo de llegar a casa, ahorita ya me estoy conectando a la computadora. Wow, ok. Jesus, ¿dónde estás? Oh, se fue Jesus. Hello? Dennis, ¿dónde estás, Dennis? Dennis? Oh, uh, Lourdes. Ah, oh, ok, pero es como el centro. So, yes, yes. Natalie, what about you? Where do you live? I live in Cuscatancingo. Ah, Cuscatancingo, yeah. pero también está como en la area centrica, right? Yeah. Uh, Yarixa, what about you? San Vicente. No, yes. San Vicente. Do you live yes. in San Vicente, Yarixa? Oh, my yes. goodness. Elizabeth, and you, where do you live? San Marco. San Martín. Mm. Ah, San Martín. No, pero Ay, Dani, se te olvidó. <ríe> San Marcos, se, se recordaba que iniciaba con, con M. Sí, sí, ah, sí. ok. Sí, es que habemos bien. como tres del grupo anterior, por eso es que él estaba recordando. Ah, ok. Ah, ok, ok. Got it. Ya, yeah, creo que, no, pero está bastante, no, pero está lejito, right? It's kind of far away. Eh, lo que sucede sí. es que las, las module habíamos dicho que podíamos salir, but algunos son... Eh, hay tres, tres compañeros de Santa Ana. And, uh, no sí, que de Huachapán, mis. Ajá, igual, Anabel, mi, Jackie, ya te quizá ya. No Ajá. podríamos, muy Pero lejos. Ana, right? uh -huh. So, yes, I know. And there Somos las que vivimos más lejos. En Norberto from Zacate, right? Sí, creo que es un poco más lejos. So that, that's the point, que es como un poquito Para difícil. Alguien nos va a ir a traer. Eso, ni modo, Jesus, hasta allá le tocó. Cabal. Que prepare un microbús grande. <risa> For ya all todos están invitándolo para invitar a que soy a todos. <laughs> no, but it would so be I nice. You know. That one, it would be nice. So by the end of the module, tal vez podemos organizar algo, you know, y vernos de afuera, right? Bueno, de hecho, so conocernos, yeah. actually. Sería <laughs> excelente. Because no es lo mismo, you know, being here and, and saying, hey, hello, we're upstairs, you know. So it would be really nice. But yeah, pe pensémosle un poquito, echémosle cabeza. And if we can do it, that would be super cool. So I'm sorry to interrupt coming back from the commercial. Uh, Ingrid, estábamos con usted. So you said okay. <laughs> that you have to submit, you have to deliver the documents for Aminsa for la próxima semana, next week. Um, what else? What other activity do you have? I have to work, I, I want. <laughs> you have to work every month. Yes, yes, I know. I what have, else? I have, I have a meeting uh, in Saturday, it's a Saturday in online. This calling my daughter. Okay. So, give me the fecha. I, give me the date. Do you have a meeting on Saturday? Uh, um, Monday. Monday is um, um, 10 o'clock. Okay. And the, and the date? What about the day? Uh -huh. It's, it's Monday. Monday. Mm -hmm. Monday. Uh -huh. March? Monday, 10 o'clock. Uh, March. March. Okay, so this month. Uh, Sorry. Other, I have two insurance appoint, appointments. Uh, the days in the, in the March 14th Monday is uh, 8 o'clock. Okay. Um, let, let me get this straight. So you have to make an appointment. You have to make an insurance appointment yeah. on Monday. Mm -hmm. On Monday, on Monday March. On Monday, Monday, 
March 14th, Monday. It's mm -hmm. uh, eight, 8 o'clock. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, very nice, exactly. So, uh, just a little Está something. Está bien así pronunciado. Sí, solamente el Monday va primero. So, primero es el día, luego el mes y luego la fecha. So, that would be on Monday. Ah, Mm -hmm. On Monday, March 20, something I think you told me. So Monday, March. Pero va el día, después el mes y después el, la fecha. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's Perfect. right. Por ejemplo, si es el 22, el marzo 22, so that would be uh, like this. So on Monday, March 22nd. Monday, March. Mm -hmm. okay. Or Monday, March 29th. Exactly. So primero el día, después el mes, and then... La date es específica. Yes. And I like it because Ingrid mencionó on Monday. So very nice job. Exactly. Para los días uh, utilizamos on, right? On Monday. Oh, yes. yes. Very nice. Okay. Okay. Uh, thank you, Ingrid. That was very good. Uh, guys, anybody else? Alguien más nos quiere compartir your program de activity? Hi, teacher. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hi there. Go ahead, me? please. Yes. Me. Okay. Um, I had to schedule the meeting uh -huh. to review last year result in Friday, March 26. Mm -hmm. Very good. From 1 p.m. to uh midnight okay wow yeah. that's long yes okay. very 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 tiring yes. that's a yeah. long schedule very yes okay. yes but you said you have to schedule schedule uh-huh or you will change a schedule va a cambiar de horario o va a programar algo es programar Toda la, la, la sesión de la presentación de resultados. Ah, oh, ok. So you are, ok. Got you. Yes. Ok. Yeah, that, that was ok. That was ok. Mm -hmm. So, that's it. Do you have another activity to make? Um, no. No. That's it. I'm on vacation. No, really? No, 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 no. Are you yeah. having vacation? April. Oh, so that's next month. Oh, yeah. Next month, yes. Okay, so yeah, guys, ¿cuándo Semana Santa? When is like the holiday? The other uh, April, mm, the, May, the finish week, or this month in March. The, ¿Cómo se dice última semana? The, last week. The last the week, creo que empieza. Last week of March. Last week of this month. Yes. I yes. think this month. This month, okay. So mm -hmm. this month yes. in April or only March. I'm, I don't April, know. I'm going to investigate. Pero sí sé que el módulo lo terminamos antes de Semana Santa, so I'm not sure. Usted estaría de nuevo con nosotros. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> because it was pretty, I was lucky que me, dejar, que me dejaron con ustedes, but normally no sucede, so... I, I don't know. I'm not quite sure. I am not quite sure. But, but we will let you know, you know. So either way. Okay, everybody. So let's go on with the next activity we have for right now. Okay. So, um, tengo acá un par de preguntas. And vamos a revisar rapidito how to make questions utilizando have to. Okay. So, uh, okay, there you go. First of all, let's take a look at the following. It says here, speak in practice, pero primero veamos cómo hacer preguntas. What do you have to do uh, today after classes? What do you have to pay this month? When do you go to, to school? Why do you have to learn English? So, si se fijan, uh, esas son WH questions, okay. Pero comenzamos con las preguntas de sí y no, de las cosas que tenemos que hacer, all right? So, um, yo estoy bien curiosa, I'm very curious, so I always like asking more questions, more details, okay? So, comenzamos con las preguntas, tienes que, do you have to? Guys, hablando de obligaciones, hablando de cosas que ustedes deben de hacer, um, 
ayúdenme con preguntas. Help me with questions. ¿Qué le puedo preguntar al resto de compañeros sobre las cosas que tienen que hacer? So do you have to, for example, do you have to send reports? Yes. So yes, I do, or no, I don't. What is your answer? Sorry. No, no worries, no worries. What is your answer? Yes, I do, or no, I don't. Yes, I do. Okay. Yes, I do. Okay. Yes, I do. Okay. Four. Yes, I do every day. Every day. Okay, five. Every day, every moment. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's so sad. Okay. Every week, every day. Yes, I do once a week. Once a week. Okay, okay. Yes. Yes, I have to send reports once uh, a week too. Okay, but not every day. Uh, Anthony? Que el, cuando, digamos, cuando lo necesitan, ¿cómo se diría? Only, yes, I do. Okay, only, <laughs> ahorita se lo escribo en el chat because that's a, a very important word. Only when it is needed. So, yes, I do, but only when it is needed. Mm. Solo cuando se necesita. Mm -hmm. Only when it is needed. Okay. So, ¿qué otras obligaciones tiene? Let's, uh, help me please with the questions. Do you have to? Arrive early. Mm, okay, aunque creo que todo sí, right? Do you have to arrive early? ¿Hay alguien a quien le permitan entrar tarde? No. No. Yes. Justify. Mm, pero así como no quiero ir ahora temprano, voy a llegar tarde. Uh, ¿Alguien puede llegar tarde? ¿Can you arrive late? No, right? No, right. No, I don't. No, 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 in my case, I, I need to arrive at my work when I assist the... The, the accident. The accident, yes. But do you need to arrive early? Necesita llegar como siempre temprano. No. Okay. I, I need to arrive when the, the customer calls. Okay, only when the customer calls. Okay. Ok, gotcha. Eh, Alguien tenía otra pregunta, pero I couldn't hear that. Eh, Moisés, what was your question? Can you repeat that? Eh, check payrolls. Eh, más que estaba preguntando de, do you have to check payrolls? Ah, ok, ok. So do you have to check payroll? Exactly. Thank you so much. That's a very good question. Guys, ¿quién tiene que revisar payroll? I know that Jarixa yes. has to check payroll. Who else? Yes, Who has payroll. to check payroll? Danny. Yes, I do this. Okay, Danny, Sandra. Danny. Okay. Danny, Sandra. Who else? ¿Quién más tiene que revisar las planillas de payroll? Uh. Who else? Uh, Giovanni, do you have to check payrolls? Sometimes, teacher. Okay, so Giovanni, sometimes. Anybody else? Jackie, what, what, Jackie, do you have to check payrolls? <clears throat> oh, Jackie's gone. Okay, okay. So <laughs> she's gone. I was waiting on that. Ingrid, what about you? Only. Only my husband. No. <laughs> Pero ese sería el payment. <laughs> so, okay. so, it's not okay, just that you have to check the payroll. But I'm really, I'm really payroll is my husband. <laughs> okay, so you have to check your husband, your husband's payment. Okay, <laughs> like the salary. <laughs> okay, so oh, yes, guys, yes. help me please. Ayúdenme con tres preguntas más in the chat, everybody. I want to see your questions. So, ¿cuáles son las obligaciones that are kind of interesting about your classmates? So, ¿qué es lo teacher. que tienes que hacer? Yes, me. Tell me. Exactly. Exactly. English teacher. Do you have to resolve the problem? 
Do you have to resolve? Okay. Do you have to yeah, I solve do problems when the people have accident car? Okay, when the okay. people have accidents. Okay. Do you have to solve problems? Yes, I do. At work. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Quizás, every quizás, day, quizás, teacher. Really? Okay. Yes, quizás quizás cambiemos la palabra y pongámosle do you have to eh, do you have to deal? Okay. La palabra deal es como tratar, okay, o lidiar con. So let's change it for the word deal yeah. with. Do you have to deal, deal with problems with. at work? Como lidiar okay. con los problemas. Mm -hmm. Because so deal. Mm -hmm. deal. un poquito más, ¿verdad? Entonces, deal with. Yes, Así I como do. que ni modo. <laughs> okay, yes, you do. Con cólera. <laughs> But deal, deal with. with. Mm -hmm. So deal with es como you. lidiar con ello. Yeah, so deal with. Or okay. for example, do you have to deal with customers? Okay. Do you have to deal with customers? Es de, de tratar al... al, al consumidor, okay, to the customer. Do, do you have to meet with partners? Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Do you have no, to I meet don't. with partners? Or, si, algunos lidian directamente con el dueño de la empresa, right? So, do you have yes. to deal with yes. the owner of the company? So, the owner of the company. Mm -hmm. Yes, I do. Okay, so there we, we have like a lot of things to ask. So, deal with es como tratar. Entonces, es una palabra más apropiada, I would say. What else? ¿Qué más tienen que hacer? What, what do you have to do? What is something that calls your attention? Do you have to the open uh, the office? Do you have to? Can, can you repeat that for me, please? Open, do you have open to? the office. Ah, okay. Do you have to open the you office sure door? Okay. Como ser el primero oh. en llegar, ¿verdad? Only Jocelyn. Only? Solo Jocelyn. Jocelyn. Jocelyn es la primera en llegar. Ella abre, abre el... el la empresa. La empresa. Sí, apertura. Yes, no I am opening. Wow. También está cargando un bolsoncito con pisto y dicen, pero a ver, no sé, chambro. <laughs> really? Is that true? Yes. Um, I change the cashiers. Wow. So you have to no. deal with money. Wow. No, work, no working in the so yeah. No, no, but the thing is that it's a little dangerous. Uh -huh, porque you yes. have to deal. Okay, voy a cambiar esto. It's it's I would it's say, it's do you have to deal with money? So, en el caso de Jocelyn, that would be a yes. Okay, so, tienen que tratar con dinero? Uh, in my case, no, I don't have to deal with money. Uh, Anna Delmi, do you deal with money? No, teacher. Customer Ay, service. Teacher. Okay. Only so, customer service. Ingrid does. Uh, let me see. Claribel, what about you? Oh, Claribel is going. I think she's having. Claribel and Jackie are, are cashier. Yeah. yeah, right. Yes, because me teacher every day. Okay. Really? Yeah, and Norberto, what about you? Do you have to deal with money too? He's a cashier. You are a cashier, right? So you have to deal with money. Si uh, maneja yes. dinero. Yes, yes. Okay, so you have to deal with money. You have to handle money. All right. Um, anybody else? ¿Quién más trabaja con dinero, guys? Well, obviously the accountants, Dan, well, Danny and Giovanni, no, right? Only the <laughs> Okay, only the bills. Okay. Yarixa, do you deal with money? Yes. Okay. Pero no debe de andar dinero. Do you have to carry the money with you? Mm. Es que eh, andarlo. Mm -hmm. 
do you have to carry or take the money with you? No. Okay. Pero sí maneja. Ajá, uh -huh. okay. So, but you don't have to take the money with you. Okay. Got it. Jesus, dígame. Oh, Jesus, levantó la mano, pero no sé si fue por error o you had a question or something. Lo escucho bien lejos, Jesús. ¿Ahora? Uh, no, permítame, no sé si es mi, mi audio. No, yo creo que es. Se escucha lejos. Se escucha bien. Sí, sí se escucha mejor ahora. Sí, es. Sí. Ya sí, me los audífonos, sí. ¿no? Yes, yes. No, que yo también a veces trabajo con dinero, como trabajo con, con bancos, eh, mensajería y cosas así. Ah, ok. So, do you have to take money sometimes to the bank? ¿Cómo? ¿Cómo? Eh, this question. Do you have to take money sometimes to the bank? Do you have to take money with you? Yes, yes. Ah, ok. okay. Remesas, cambios de cheque. Ah, uh, okay, okay. I think that's a very, I don't know, it's been delicado, right? Because si le llegan a perder, si le llegan a robar, or something bad happens on the way, so it's been, been delicado. Okay, okay, I see. So I don't like working with money, but yeah, anyways. Okay, everybody, tiene su currency también, teacher. Dígame, Dani. Pay currency. No sé si uh, dinero los falso. Cambios. Dinero falso. Dinero falso. Uh -huh. O oh, fake currency. Yes. Yes, yes, exactly. So fake money, fake bills, uh -huh. fake currency. Yeah, that's very dangerous as well. So, uh, guys, uh, can I see your questions, please? Me ayuden con uh, las preguntas en el chat. Let me just read them super quick. Let me take a look at them, please. So, si ya las tienen listas, you can share them as well. Solo déjenme echarle like. Take a look at them. Thank you, Ana Delmi. Okay, that's a very good question. Thank you, Jackie, that's okay. Uh, solo sin la I, me imagino que la I se le fue con deal. <laughs> no worries, I got you. Okay, okay, good, but that's a good question. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Yerixa. That's okay. Anybody else has a question done? Alguien más tiene ya preguntas listas? Okay.
they have to study on Sunday. Okay, that's all right. Eh, only Norberto, eh, en vez de the, podemos cambiarlo para on. Do you have to study on Sunday? Lo demás super bien. So do you have to study on Sunday? Do you have to organize meeting? Okay, that's all right. Gotcha. Thank you, Brian. Do you have to take an exam? Do you have to meet the schedule? Okay. Uh, Ana, tell me, meet the schedule, I understand que es como apegarse a su horario, ¿verdad? Do you have to meet the schedule? Yes, teacher. Okay, okay, that's como all right. Como cumplir un horario. Mm -hmm. Exactly, okay, nice. You have to work on Sunday, okay. Jesus, that's okay, solo en vez de at, con los días de la semana vamos a utilizar on. Do you have to work on Sunday? On Monday, on Sunday, on Saturday, mm -hmm. lo demás súper bien, solo on. Okay, guys, so I believe uh, most of you, algunos ya tienen más preguntas, right? But in the time that is going to take you para digitarlas, vamos a practicarlas, all right? So, uh, vamos a ir a los grupos and, uh, okay, vamos a entrevistar al compañero. What are the activities that they have to do? Algo bien importante, guys, necesito que tomen notas. I want you to write down quién les dice así, okay? Remember, the answer solamente es yes, I do or no, I don't. Eso es todo. Because my pregunta is bien cerrada, solo, do you have to? Tienes que hacerlo, sí o no. Do you have to send reports? Do you have to arrive early? Uh, do you have to wear a uniform? Okay. Do you have to go to the office? Especialmente porque ahora algunos se quedan en la casa trabajando. Uh, do you have to clock in? Okay, debe de marcar. Do you have to clock in? All right. Debe de cambiarse y o llegando a la oficina y ponerse uniforme, do you have to change your clothes, etc. So, please tomen nota de, que, de quién les dice que sí lo hacen, because ya lo vamos a reportar, ¿ok? So, I will give you a couple of minutes para que vayan rapidito a los grupos, entrevisten a los compañeros. So, si tienen una pregunta, dos preguntas, están bien, porque los demás también tienen one or two questions, ¿ok? And you can interview. Entrevisten a todos, please. Interview everybody in your group. So, everybody, let's go. Vámonos, let's go there. Guys, eh, a todos les cayó la, la invitación. Do you have the invitation? Sunday. Oh, 
I will um, uh, repeat the answer, please. One more time. Uh, do you have to the study uh, Sunday on Sunday? No, uh, I don't. No. No, I don't. Okay. Uh, do you have to uh, exercise on Saturday? No, what? I don't. <laughs> no, I don't. Okay, okay. Have to, like have to. Yes, I have to. <laughs> Pero que quieres otra cosa, you know? <laughs> Because his question is, do you have to do exercise? We have to do exercise every day. But the problem is that we don't want to sometimes. <laughs> yes, teacher. <laughs> Guys, do you do exercise? I don't want, teacher. I don't uh -huh. want. I, it's hard for me. Do you do exercise? Sometimes. Sometimes. Okay. Sometimes. So, sometimes. Okay, sometimes as well. Natalie, Norberto, what about you? Do you do exercise regularly? Um, I do exercise, but uh, now sometimes. Okay, yes, yeah, sometimes. Okay. Yes. Norberto and you? Uh, with, with <laughs> really? No. <laughs> uh, with Weekly. 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 Oh, weekly. really? I thought you said. Okay. So you what do you mean by weekly? I guess I refer to weekly. Once a week, twice a week, uh, every one, day. One, 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 uh, one, one, once a week. One hour. One hour. One hour. Yes. One hour every week. One hour every week. Ah, okay. Yes. No, but that's okay. I go to walk. Sometimes I walk on Saturday or Sunday, but yeah, maybe one hour or two hours. Pero eso es todo. That's it. <laughs> so yes. that's mucho. It's not a lot. Yes. Okay. I I have uh, some question. Um. But uh, Jose, uh, do you have to present a yearly report at your work? Mm, yes, yes, I do. A ver quién más está con nosotros. No puedo ver quién más está con nosotros. Ana Delmi. Brenda, uh, pero creo que Brenda se ha levantado ahorita. Elizabeth está por acá. Ah, no, ahí está Brenda. Bueno, Ana Delmi, uh, do you have to? Okay, Ana Delmi, do you have to deal with bad clients? Review the quality. Of, of fruit, of to work. No. No. Do you have to clean your office? Um, yes, yeah, I do. No, I don't. Do you have do you have to prepare a birthday gift at um sometime sometime person? Did you have? Do you have to prepare prepare a birthday uh, is a person to a person? No, no, I don't. No. no. Only no, 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 no,
Sumar yeah. Rebeca y tú. Yeah. Recursos, ah. recursos humanos. Yeah. ¿Qué ah, recursos humanos? Yes. You, you yes. have to. Aunque no le guste. Every, every, every month. Uh -huh. Ya no me, ya no me acordaba. No, I don't. No, I don't. Me, no, I don't. El fin de, no, el viernes pasado cerramos la alcaldía al mediodía y nos fuimos todas las mujeres a celebrar el cumpleaños de una compañera. Nos fuimos a, a, a Berlín, aquí en Usulután, eh, no. por la Laguna de Alegría. Un clima súper rico, bien heladito. Wow. Fuimos a un restaurante que se llama Alto TJ, que tiene una vista súper genial. Luego nos fuimos a un hostal que pues, hay como un museo a comer unas crepas y así celebramos los cumpleaños. <risa> Compañera, wow. no podemos, no me puedes entrevistar para trabajar en tu empresa. Vámonos. <risa> la alcaldía, ¿verdad? Puedo ir, en, puedo ir en entrevista a la alcaldía para que me, me, me pueda ir con a dar esos lujos. <laughs> ah, claro. <laughs> I, I like that, you know, so it's, it's bien genial. So, que, que le celebren el cumpleaños así, yes. especially si es como todo el grupo. Really cool. That's nice. Hasta dan ganas de ir a trabajar así. Eso como, <laughs> como, como, es como, ajá, eso iba a decir, es como un incentivo que le dan, y qué bueno. Sí, no, y que el alcalde es súper flexible en ese aspecto. Compañera, por favor, me puedes agregar a la lista de los de los futuros de los futuros of employees. Yes. Okay. Oh, I love your dog. Yeah. It's cute. What is your dog's name? Oh, it's so cute. Yes. What is your dog's name? Bully. Dolly, it's a girl. Ro, Ro. Rolly. Yeah. Wow, he's so cute. Okay. Yes. Uh, guys, eh, well, Jocelyn es un poquito mal de salud, but, you know, veo que también acá está Jackie. Hey, Jackie. Hey, you look very nice in your picture. Hey. And also Daisy. Hi, teacher. Hello. Varios, varios estamos enfermos, teacher. Sick. Solo yo uh -huh. y yo sé. Oh, are you sick? Are you feeling sick? I'm feeling sick. Sorry to hear that. Yeah. Quizás el, es ya la temporada, you know, que uno se empieza a enfermar and everything. So, oh, yeah. hay como una temporada. También el clima ¿no? molesta. <laughs> También eso, it's true. So, you get like the, the fever, so, you get bad. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys. So, it's nicer. Los dejo seguir. Solo que no sea coronavirus, guys. Be careful, please. Try to take care of yourself. No, teacher. So los dejo seguir here. En Ginao, en Calzoneta y en Centro. ¿Dónde? Allá la U. Hey, no. A la U. En serio. Sí, en serio. Yeah. O sea, preguntar un día que, te, que estés con Giovanni para que se de la duda. Todos me recuerdan por eso. Ahí viene no. Jimmy. Ahí viene. No, pero... no lo voy a decir. No lo voy a decir. Dale, dale. Decí, decílo, no, no. Pregunte. Other question. <risa> El miedo me tiene grave. No, no, no. No, 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 do you have to, to check uh, work papers? No, I don't. No, I don't. No, I don't. No, I don't. Um, do you have... You know, so, suddenly sanitized... everybody got quiet, you know. <laughs> I just heard <laughs> that you were like having fun, talking talking a lot, and suddenly todos están como bien calladitos. So I'm like, okay, what happened? No, no, sí. <laughs> es que no, no. Es que estamos pensando las preguntas. <laughs> no, pero sí. You're still thinking. 
teníamos nos hicimos acá. bastante Yes, I do. Uh, okay, and Jesus, do you have uh, organized a meeting? Yes, I do. Um, Danny? No, I don't. Ah, Sandra también está en este grupo. No, ya no. no he dicho nada. Bien. Sandra Roda. Ella, no he dicho nada. Ella, sin duda. Do you... Hello, Marvin. Thanks for coming Hola. back. Gracias de por sí me da un problema en internet, teacher. Me imagino. Quizás todavía está mal. Si quiere, apague un ratito la cámara mientras se le estabiliza un poco para que no lo vaya a sacar. Eso quizás puede funcionar un poco mejor. Hey guys, uh, thanks for coming back. Okay, so that was a nice talk. I heard que la mayoría agregó nuevas preguntas, you know, so that was really good. So, espero que hayan tomado un par de notitas, okay, that you remember your classmates and why notes are important because ahora nos van a contar qué es lo que los compañeros tienen que hacer. ¿Cómo lo hacemos? Well, look at this. Check this out. ¿Cómo voy a hablar de mi compañero? Voy a hablar de she or voy a hablar de him. Ok. So, va a haber un pequeño cambio. Ya no digo have to y luego qué tiene que hacer, sino que en vez de decir eso, yo voy a cambiar el have to por has to. Ok. And that's it. So, for example, I heard, ok, that eh, René mencionó. So René says, oh, que él tiene que llegar cuando es necesario. So René has to arrive early or fast at the car accidents. Okay. So at the car accident scene. Scene. Okay. There you go. Mm, so okay. because we are talking about he or she. Hacemos este pequeño cambio de has to. Okay? Has to. So, um, guys, give me some ideas, please. ¿Qué es lo que los compañeros tienen que hacer? What do your classmates have to do? Moshe, eh, he, he has to check uh, payrolls. Check, okay, he has to okay. check payrolls, okay. He wow, Moshe has to do it. All right, thank you, Brian. Anybody else? Mm -hmm. Yes, Ingrid, go. Um, Yaritza. Uh -huh. She is um, preparing the days and the people is in the in, in workplace. Okay, she has to organize the month. birthday party. Yes. Very, month. very mm -hmm. nice. So she has to organize parties. Yes, very good. Anybody yeah. else, guys? Anybody else? Uh, Jesus has to... Uh, driving uh, work. Okay, so Jesus has to drive at work. Okay, Jesus, it's only driving or riding también, o ambas? Ambas. Okay, so Jesus has to drive 
Okay, at work, and also he has to ride a motorcycle. Okay, cool. Thank you. Anybody else? She has. She has to travel. Who? Who? Means? She has to travel for the job. Who? Quién de los compañeros? Who? Ah, uh, I no me acuerdo cómo se llama. Oh, guys, <laughs> quién viaja? Eh, qué mala onda. Who travels. Qué mala eres. Yeah. Juliana, ¿qué no, so, sí. eh, no le ¿Qué me haga? Es mi. Es una niña de braques. Natalie. Ah. Y, y Dalia. Natalie. Natalie. Natalie, ¿do you travel? Uh, yes. Uh, sometimes I travel. Uh, ¿Como el fin de semana pasado? Oh, to Guatemala. But ha ido. Uh -huh. Pero solo trabaja en Centroamérica. Or do solo you Centroamérica. Okay. Solo pero... Centroamérica, pero es por capacitaciones, congresos, okay. cosas así. En uh -huh. last week era como Very una invitación. Good. Was that an invitation? In last week, uh, I, I have my business. I, I go to Guatemala to buy products and I. Eh, um, okay. Yo vendo acá. Entonces, oh. I take products in, in, in El Salvador, oh, uh, I take and go to Guatemala, and I, yo los vendo allá. <laughs> oh, so you, you, okay, business. so you work with merchandise, but, what do you sell? Merchandise. Excuse me? What do you sell? What products do you sell? Ah, uh, for example, uh, here in El Salvador, we don't have... Uh, productos oncológicos en Guatemala okay. sí hay entonces yo los traigo y los vendo con los colegas yeah. eh, aquí en El Salvador hay productos que no hay en Guatemala entonces yo lo llevo y lo vendo allá wow producto oncológico you said. Eh, es producto para quimioterapia en pacientes que tienen cáncer Wow. Caso de perros y gatos. Oh, ah, ok. Pensé que para personajes. Was like, what? No. Okay. <laughs> no hay. Pero, okay. eh, pero sí, son de, son de uso humano, pero aquí no hay. Entonces, hay, 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 los necesitamos. Los colegas que hacen quimioterapia. Que hacen, que mm. Entonces, mm. Ajá. Ajá. yo aprovecho las deficiencias de aquí y de allá. Y voy, But llevo nice. y traigo. Nice. That's very yeah. interesting. So you are very, very disnera. No, she, she uh, is a very good. Mm -hmm. And sometimes I work in in a hospital in Guatemala because uh, the la dueña del hospital me contrata para cubrirla en vacaciones, en sus vacaciones. Mm. Ay, very nice. Sí. So that's cool. That's cool because cambia de ambiente laboral and that's very yes. important to you keep it fresh. Yes. Okay, cool. So Natalie travels. Yeah, she has to travel for work. Okay, guys, anybody else? Alguien más tiene one, two more, so we can finish with that. De lo que escucharon de los compañeros, and you were like, oh, yes, that's nice. Algo que les haya parecido interesting from your classmates. Danny, he has every Saturday sanitize to her office. Oh, okay. So he has to sanitize the office, okay. I don't do it. <laughs> okay, that's important, I think. Okay, thank you. So thanks everybody. That was very interesting. Me traes unas cabras. What's that? Unas cabras. Ah, unas cabras. No, no, no. No, no, no. ¿De dónde quieren las cabras? What kind of business are you, are you oh, doing uh, here, guys? It's, it's probably... Vente de la mano. No, okay. so, she is not a ah, guys. Una, es cabro. Es, es licor, beers, es cabro. Cabro, oh, yeah. cabro, cabro. 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 Cabro, en el taxi lo más agarrado como el de San Miguel. No, guys, no fomentemos el cuatrerismo. <risa> no, 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 cabra no puedo traer. <risa> pero sí, pero sí hago eso, sí traigo y llevo encomiendas. 
Porque ah, todo okay. negocio. Es so mala. So 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 solo me imaginaba yo no a Natalie y ella subida en el bus con la cabra. Eso definitely that's not like no, no, no me deja pasarlo. Si me dejaran pasar animales, podría traer mini pigs, este. Oh, ay, qué lindo. <ríe> Pero ah, no me dejan. No dejan snakes. traer animales. En una no. mochila que lo he hecho. Están pidiendo snakes. You can get some masacuatas here, but no, no, I don't think it's a good idea. So, <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> I don't know who Dami, wants snakes. Dami. No. <laughs> don't ask for snakes. Okay, everybody, it was really nice to, to, to be with you today. Terminamos mañana, segunda semana, people. Y ellos solo nos faltan ustedes. Dijero, una consulta. Dígame, Brian. Eh, Habrá midterm este, en este módulo, sí. Tenemos que hacerlo ya o no escuchado. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, guys, tenemos hasta mañana para completar la sesión número dos completa. Eso incluye sesión dos. Y después de la sesión dos hay una evaluación que es como medio, right? Si lo tienen es? en español, dice examen de medio término. Mi, mi, en en inglés, si la plataforma la tiene en inglés, dice midterm. So that is the midterm exam. Tenemos hasta mañana y de ser posible terminarlo ahora, right? No está largo, no está difícil. And si necesitan ayuda o, o tienen alguna pregunta, let fácil. me know. ¿Quién ya lo terminó? ¿Quién terminó la parte 2? No. Yes, yes. yes. Sí. excelente. Sí. Super proud of you. Nice. Guys, si todavía les falta, desde please complete lunes, the exercise. Desde el lunes le hice todo. Right. Desde el lunes hice todo Perfecto. lo de la semana. Ya se le... es, es mejor, así ya no está con el pendiente del viernes de me faltan todos los ejercicios, you know. So it's even better y usted se toma el tiempo para resolverlos. So see you everybody. See you tomorrow. Have a wonderful night. Enferma, enferma, pero, enferma, pero, enferma, pero estudiosa. Bye. 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 Bye.